this pop punk trio shines brighter than anyone. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 Paramore songs. For this list, we've chosen a mix of tracks comprised of the band's fan favorites, as well as their most commercially successful songs. Number 10, Pressure. Tell me what our time went, and if it was time well spent. Where better to begin our list than with the debut single that started it all? Though it's one of the few Paramore singles that failed to land on the Billboard Hot 100, its lyrical content and impressive vocals from lead singer Haley Williams gave the band a great first impression. Today, it continues to be played live in virtually all Paramore shows, proving this to be one major fan favorite that Paramore is far from better off without. The pressure to create a catchy debut single didn't get to this Tennessee trio. I can feel the pressure. It's getting closer. Number 9, Monster. You were my conscience, so solid now you like water. Released as a single for the second Transformer sequel, the song served as Paramore's first endeavor following the departure of members Josh and Zach Farrow. With the lyrics often interpreted as an elusive farewell to the Farrow brothers, the song was further noted for its sonic elements of grunge and hard rock absent in previous Paramore songs. Regardless, it was precisely those confessional lyrics and grim sound that spawned a new wave of followers. Tightening the song's success to a peak position of 36 on the Billboard Hot 100 and 23 in the alternative rock category. Number 8, Still Into You. As the second single from their self-titled album, Still Into You was noted for yet another drastic shift musically and lyrically. Showcasing a different kind of love song with perky pop rock melodies and enthusiastic poetry, it's one of a number of songs from Paramore that continues to beautifully demonstrate their musical versatility. Maybe not a day goes by. As its release as a single, it became a successful summer anthem, with sales that made it the band's fourth platinum hit in the US and their first multi-platinum song overseas. Number 7. That's What You Get. No, sir. Stylistically described as a power pop rock song with uplifting riffs and a snappy chorus, the song was appropriately released at a time the band members had begun to experience their first set of internal downturns. Released as the final single for the sophomore record, nearly a year after its release, the single didn't sell so well right out of the gates. However, it did eventually pick up in sales to become gold certified in the US and was selected to be a playable track on Rock Band 2. Number 6, The Only Exception. When I was younger, I saw my daddy cry and curse at the wind 
an exceptional piece adored by critics and fans alike. This song proved to be one of the group's more mature deviations with its graceful tone and gentle cadence. Maybe I know somewhere deep in my soul that love never lasts. Infusing the same intense lyricism that only a Paramore song can do right, the song received only moderate radio airplay upon its single release, but it did go on to achieve platinum honors from the US and the UK. The song's success and potency further paved the way for an EP featuring different recorded and live renditions of the song, which eventually received a Grammy nomination. Number 5. Decode Written for the first entry into the Twilight Saga, this song received stronger praise than the film it was attached to from critics and fans alike. Spawning a new wave of followers, this song was noted for staying true to Paramore's gloomy style, whilst being able to perfectly capture the sentiments of the Twilight narrative. The song is notable for showing off the larger-than-life vocals of frontwoman Haley Williams in the explosive chorus, which helped in earning the band their second Grammy nomination. There's nothing to decode here, just one kick-ass alternative rock tune. Number 4. Crush 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 Nothing truly does compare to a quiet evening alone, unless of course, you're rocking out to this song. An electrifying tune about the hesitation and insanity to move past the boundaries of friendship, our number 4 coincidentally peaked at number 4 on Billboard's Hot 100 in the alternative rock category, making it the band's second highest peaking position on the chart. Let's be more than this now. Though the song has only achieved a gold status in the US, it remains a massive fan favorite as it perfectly captures the band's early pop punk sound. Number 3. Brick by Boring Brick Described by critics, fans, and the band as a twisted fairy tale in the form of a song, the poetry found in this release create a truly fantastic sensation, reminiscent of Alice in Wonderland. Released as the second single off their third studio album, this track is noted for its consistency of climactic sounds and its haunting lyrics about the trials and tribulations of reality. Top it all off with an equally grim music video and you have one hell of a great tune. Number 2. Ignorance. If I'm a bad person, you don't like me. Well, I guess I'll make my own way. Any true Paramore fan will tell you that the band is not all about rainbows and butterflies, and her silver medal recipient is arguably the best proof of that. Described by vocalist Haley Williams as a confrontational song about the frustrations of feeling alone and insecure, this song was commended for its rapturing sound 
and the destructive nature of its execution, both in the studio and in live performances. Ignorance is your new best friend. Ignorance is your new best friend. And this is the best thing that could have happened. The first track written for Brand New Eyes, it was likewise released as the album's first single, showcasing Paramore's boldness to not only go out, but to also re-emerge swinging. Before we go out in style with our number one pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Number one, misery business. I'm in the business of misery. Let's take it from the top. She's got a body like an hourglass, ticking like a clock. Taking top honors is the song that is considered to be Paramore's breakthrough hit, raising them from their underground roots and into mainstream light. As the opening single to their sophomore record, the free-spirited nature of the song was beautifully aligned to the title, the album and the reputation that the band would build from it. Its fun lyrics and punchy melody had it quickly finding its way to numerous video games and TV shows. Not one of them it has since garnered double platinum status in the US and continues to stir quite a riot at live performances. What? our list? Which Paramore song keeps your heartstrings in tune? It's just my humble opinion, but it's one that I believe in. For more Rockin' Top 10s published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com.